Hey everyone, look at this. A girl, a dragon, a full story with real dialogue and smooth animation. Today I will find the Spring Lantern. Do not worry, I will help you. Thank you. I was scared. I can glide a little. Hold my hand. We try together. Stay close. I hear bells. Is that the lantern? Sora 2 is a new AI model from OpenAI that can generate videos with sound and dialogue. It understands motion, physics, and lighting better than the older version. So the results look much more natural. You can normally use it in the Sora app, but right now there's no official support for Comfy UI. So in this video, I am going to connect Sora 2 to Comfy UI manually using a custom node that lets us generate full HD videos straight from the workflow, even if you have low VRAM. The custom node we are going to install is called Comfy UI Zen Zen node, not included in the Comfy UI library, so we'll download it manually. All right, so let's install everything step by step. First, open your Comfy UI folder. Inside that, you'll find a folder named Custom Nodes. We are going to install the new Comfy UI Zen Zen node there. Now, open the Custom Node folder in Command Prompt or Terminal. So, once you are inside the command window, you have to clone the repository for the custom node and just type this command git clone paste the repository link here after you run that command it will start downloading a new folder inside custom nodes so when it finishes you'll see a folder named comfy ui zen zen that means the node has been added successfully next we need to install all the required libraries. So open that new folder in the same command window and type pip install r requirement.txt. This command will install all the Python li libraries needed for this node to work properly. Wait until it finishes. It may take a few minutes depending on your internet speed. So once it's done, run Comfy UI. Now that we have installed the node, we need the API key to make it work. Without the API key, Comfy UI won't be able to connect to the Sora 2 model online. So here is what you have to do. First, open your browser and go to the ai.t8star.cn website. I have added the link in the description. So when you open the page, it might appear in Chinese. So first change the language to English from the top right corner. After that, click on register to create a new account. When you log in, you will land on the dashboard. Now you go to the wallet tab. So here you will see a free balance of $0.20. That's your free trial credit. Each video you generate will cost a small amount. For example, one 15 second HD video usually costs around $0.02. So with the free credit, you can make around nine or 10 videos easily. Next, go to the token section. This is where we create our API key. Click on create key, type any name you want, like free Sora key, anything you want. For expiration, choose unlimited or set it to any future date you prefer, like 2030. Leave the rest of the settings as they are. And finally, click Submit. Now, your API key will be generated. Copy it and keep it safe. You will need to paste it inside Comfy UI. Now, go back to your Comfy UI workflow. Find the open AI Sora node and look for the API key input box. Paste your key there. Also, check that your base URL matches the Sora API site. 
usually it's the same website where you registered. That's it. Now your Comfy UI is connected to Sora 2 through the cloud API. So now you are ready to start generating videos. There is a section called load image. Here you can upload an image if you want to use a specific character or object in your video. For this example, I am uploading a photo of a puppy. So once the image is loaded, check your base URL. Make sure it's the same one from the Sora website where you created the API key. Then in the model section, you will find multiple options. You can choose between portrait, landscape or HD versions of the model. So if you want a 15 second HD video in landscape format, select Sora video to landscape HD 15 seconds. And if you want it in vertical, choose Sora video to portrait HD. Now in the prompt section, type the idea or story you want to generate. For example, I'll write adventure of a little puppy. Then set the aspect ratio to 16 ratio 9 for landscape or 9 ratio 16 for portrait. Make sure HD is equal to true and duration is 15 seconds. Once everything is ready, click generate. Now the node will send your prompt and image to the cloud API and in a few seconds you will get a URL for your video. Copy that URL, open it in your browser and you will see your video generated. It's a 15 second clip with audio made from your prompt and image. And the best part is your character stays consistent throughout the video. So now you have successfully generated your first video. This is a story about a curious little puppy who couldn't sit still. He chased butterflies, splashed with frogs, and followed every new scent the breeze carried. From sunny fields to shady forests and over rambling streams, adventure was everywhere. Good night, little adventure. So let me show you a few more tests I did with Sora 2 inside Comfy UI. And for that, I tried uploading an image of a woman and wrote a simple prompt like women walking in a night market. I selected the model Sora video to landscape HD 15 seconds and kept the duration to 15 seconds. After hitting generate, I this night market is just getting started. The rain left the streets glossy, so all the neon bounces right back up at you. Skewers on the left smell amazing, and every few steps there's another stall sending out steam like this. I love how the colors change with every corner. It's kind of like a video where the same women from my image walks naturally through a night market. You can actually see the camera following her from behind. Neon lights, soft reflections. The best part is that character stays consistent. Her face, clothes and overall identity remains the same as in the for reference image. That shows how good Sora 2 is at maintaining continuity across frames. But there is something important you should know. When I tried generating videos using a real person's face, I got an error saying the content was restricted due to a policy violation. That means, that means, Sora 2 currently blocks or filters realistic human likenesses probably to prevent misuse or deep fake type videos. So if you upload a real person's photo, it might not generate anything. So after testing that, I moved on to the next experiment. Generating a full animated story with dialogue using only text prompts. And for this test, I disabled the load image section because I wanted to create everything purely from text prompts. And in the prompt box, I started writing a small story, something like a cartoon fairy tale. And here is what I wrote. A brave girl in a blue cloak runs across a meadow. 
Toward a small village, the camera moves slowly from left to right. Then I click generate. And the result came out beautifully. The animation looked like a clean TV cartoon, but blending problem, it looked unnatural. And to fix that, enhance the prompt. I wanted to see if Sora 2 could handle dialogues and scenes like a short film. So I added short story in the prompt with dialogue. So now let me show you what Sora 2 actually generated from that story prompt. And as Today, you can I see, will find the spring lantern. it followed worry. everything I, I wrote, Thank you. scene I was by scene. I can glide a so in scene one, Today, we see Mika find... standing in a bright meadow near a village. Today, I will find. Today, I'll find the spring lantern. The spring in scene lantern. two, Do not worry. we cut the forest edge. You. Tall grass, small flowers, and soft sunlight exactly as written. Here is Zozo, the tiny dragon, stuck behind the fence. The spring lantern. Do not worry. I will help you. I help you. Then Zozo replies, Thank you. I was scared. Next scared. the third scene by the river. I was scared. The bridge is broken. Can Camera and the low. I was scared. Light reflection on the water. I was scared. I can Zozo glide a little. Says, Hold my hand. We try. Now finally, let's come to scene four the darker part of the forest. Here are tall trees, light fog, small glowing fireflies on the ground. Hold my hand. We try together. Stay close. I hear bells. Is that the lantern? So yes, Sora 2 followed my full script exactly. It matched the dialogue, emotion and camera movement without missing a single point. So that's what surprised me the most. It felt like watching my written story come alive automatically. So now you know how to run Sora 2 inside ComfyUI and make real videos with story and voice for free. A short tip before you go, keep your prompts clear like camera slow push or soft morning light. The more detail you give, the better results you get. Here, a 15 second HD video costs around 2 cents only. So that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed this tutorial, please hit like and subscribe to our channel. I'm testing more Sora 2 updates next, so don't miss that. See you soon. Bye bye.